come to this age, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind that you may prove that what the will of God is, that which is good and well-pleasing and perfect. Amen. For I say through the grace given to me, to everyone among you, not to think more highly of himself than he ought to think, mm -hmm. but to think so as to be sober-minded mm -hmm. as God has appointed to each a measure of faith. Mm -hmm. the, thought, the, the thought here is the process of sanctification, I mean, of, of uh, transforming. Mm -hmm. May we pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, we approach your throne of grace, asking for grace and mercy at a time of need uh, to speak on the behalf of uh, these scriptures and open them up that we might be able to, to they may be able to transform our our thinking and we express Christ in us. We come against every every demonic spirit, every demonic thought, everything that's fleshly. We come against it right now in the name of Jesus. We thank you. We praise you. In Jesus' name and for his sake, amen. 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 <coughs> the, um, the word transformation actually means metaphors, metaphorsis. That's what it really means. And it means change. Uh, the caterpillar yeah. is a, <coughs> one that changes. Mm -hmm. um, to a butterfly mm -hmm. over a process. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I think it takes about six weeks or something like that. Well, after after he goes into the his cocoon mm -hmm. and then he comes out, he looks like a he is a butterfly. Yeah. He's something totally different yeah. than yeah. what he yeah. is now. Yeah. Amen. And so Paul is using the same word here. Mm -hmm to transform the believer. Now, the thought here, there are many animals that go, and insects and termites that go through transformation. I have just a few here. You have the frog from a tadpole. You have the salamander and the, and the caterpillar. There are many, many others. So you can Google it on your smartphone and see the many animals that go through a process of, trans of, tr of transformation. <coughs> the caterpillar, first he goes into a larva, puba, uh, and then he turns into a butterfly. Mm -hmm. If you see it here, it looks like a, a worm. Mm -hmm. Here it is free to fly. Ah, amen. Hallelujah. It's amen. to express it, it's, itself. Man. The thought here is that the the natural process mm -hmm. it. that a butterfly goes through is not his. Mm -hmm. right. It's actually mm -hmm. something that God has put into his DNA. You got to see this. You got to see it. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. when the butterfly goes through his transformation and the frog, they don't look alike. Mm -hmm. But they have there has been a, tre a, tre a tremendous change mm -hmm. in the way they look. Mm -hmm. And the, the natural process is something that takes no effort on the individual himself to accomplish. Okay. Mm -hmm. you, you, can you see that? Mm -hmm. it, it, it happens because God has put it in their, in their DNA or in, yes, their, yes, in, their, yes. in, in, in their biological being. Now the believer, Paul, is saying something similar, <coughs> but it's it's not it's not natural. Come on, amen. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's why it's such a hard thing for an individual to be looking like Jesus, unless the metamorphosis is Christ Himself performing the act. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord. I hope that makes sense. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Amen. Yes. And this is what Paul is saying here. Uh, be you transformed uh, by the renewing of your mind. Um, mm -hmm. Transformation has it with it 
a process of changing the inside, not the not the container per, 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 per se, but the inside. So when it's put on display, you can see the you can see what has really happened on the inside. Amen. I think there's a word for it. Uh, we use it a lot of time. Walk that walk and talk that talk. Amen. Whatever you have on the inside, eventually it will show up on the outside. Yes. 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 The, the transformation here. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's not natural. Mm -hmm. No believer in Christ can naturally change himself into the image of Christ. Amen. Amen. No. Amen. The image, the, the, the person of Christ is already in you. Yes. And he does the change. Yes, sir. But, but, but this, is, this is key. Mm -hmm. But we have to work with him yes. Yes. to get it done. Yes, sir. Amen. In the natural realm, it doesn't take much effort on the on the um, that that uh, lava or whatever is is being transformed, it happens naturally. Mm -hmm. It is a process that happens naturally. You can't stop it mm -hmm. because of natural process. Mm -hmm. Amen. Now, the the Bible does speak of the fact that as a man thinketh, so is he. <clears throat> there is a lot of religious people or religious believers or religious counterfeits or whatever you call them that actually in a uncertain terms hypocritically proclaim to be transformed. Oh, okay. Yeah. Very simple. But they're not. Because the transforming isn't the outward man. It is the inward person. The, the transforming occurs there. It has to go down to the deepest part of man, which is the spirit. Then the soul. And then it expressed through the body. Yes, sir. That's why Thank Paul you. said, present your body yes. as a living soul. It's dead. Now. It, remember, it's dead. But you are the one to present it. Yes. So it can it can present the new transformation that has occurred on the inside. Yes. And they can see it. Yes. Uh, I think what would help us a lot here, for me it did, was when I went to the service back in 19... Blah, blah, blah. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> and when I came back, my mother said, Boy, you, you done changed. Come on here. Mm -hmm. Come on. See, two, two, it. two years, no, three years in Newport News did a lot of changes. And, three, and two years in the Army did even more. Mm -hmm. So when I came back to my home, dad and mom, they didn't recognize me mm -hmm. because they had I had been transformed. Mm -hmm. No, not, not in 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 the natural sense. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So there are people who say I, I'm a new person. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but what you knew in? Have went to school yes. and have been transformed in their thinking, yeah. mm -hmm. but it's not Christ. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. There are those who go to who religious schools and they get a lot of uh, a religious teaching and doxology. But when they present that stuff that's within them, mm -hmm. it is not Christ. Come on, Harvey. Because Christ has to transform them. Mm -hmm. That school or that whatever they went through has transformed mm -hmm. them into being something that they are, they are, they are not Christ. Mm -hmm. um, there's another uh, called trans. Has to do with monsters, mm. like um, Frankenstein. Mm -hmm. He was transformed, mm -hmm. and like the the uh, Wolfman, mm -hmm. he one he one person a day, and the next the next hour when the moon comes up, he's another person. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And uh, and like Superman, mm -hmm. uh, one day he's this mild mild mannered person walking yeah. down the street, and something happens and runs into this phone booth. Yeah. And it comes out completely transformed. Mm -hmm. But actually, they're the same person. Mm -hmm. 
they're just in a in a role that they're playing. Okay. And sometimes yeah. in 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 the religious setting, in denomination setting, and traditional setting, what you see and what is actually the natural man dressed up okay. is something that's really not Christ. That, that's what I'm saying. And this is what Paul is saying here. Uh, be you transformed by what? But he also cautioned not to be conformed to this world. That means stop acting like this world. And when you go to get some teaching or some religion, I mean some uh, scripture, don't conform it to like the world. <laughs> the sad story is that we see that all the time. Where people have become uh, physically changed outside, but inside they're the same person. We was talking to a young man a couple of days ago at the gym. I said, well, great, you look, you look good. I said, your shoulder's so wide, you can't even get in the bathroom. He said, I have a problem getting in the bathroom. I said, well, what about that guy in here? Mm -hmm. What about that, that other man? Mm -hmm. And he looked at me, and I said, well, what about that guy? I mean, the, the guy outside looks great, mm -hmm. but what about that rascal? When I said <laughs> rascal, his eyes went up. And, and, and we the, um, we develop a relationship to the point of where I can yeah, say that. Yeah, right. Now I wouldn't, cause big as it was, I wouldn't say it. But <laughs> just, just, just up said it to him. But I had to. We had to break through all that stuff, and so that's why friendship is so important yeah, yeah. to develop friendship. Right. And sometimes it takes weeks and months mm -hmm. to get to a place where you can say some things to some people that God wants you to say to people. Mm -hmm. And He says, uh, you, you, "You're right." He said, that rock, he said, the guy inside is really rotten. Mm -hmm. He still yeah. actually said that. Uh -huh. yeah. I said, but, uh, I said, but the guy outside looks wonderful. Yeah. And, but we can't get the, the two confused here. Well. <laughs> because what you see is not really what you, what you are. Yeah. Amen. Am I right? Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Because men, we've been big hypocrites. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we, we, one way we run our, our wives and our girlfriends, one way. Mm -hmm. And but once soon as the door closed, we some else. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ain't we? Yeah. And of course, we are not gonna take that from you. You got to let you got you girls have the same yeah. same privilege. Yeah. Once you, you get out person, you somebody. Yeah. But as soon as the door open the door and you get out, you somebody yeah. else. Amen. Now that's that's not saying that's all the time. But I'm saying we do have those opportunities yeah. where we put on masquerade. Yeah. Right. 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 But what we want to do, we want to be real. Amen. And being real inside is that the Christ has to work his his magic in us to conform us, our soul, our mind, our will, our desire, our very being yes, into that person that we put on display. Yes, sir. Uh, I think we can use the scripture, uh, if you see me, you see the Father. Okay. Yes, yes sir. That, that, that was what I'm talking about. Yes. He went up on into the mountains and Peter and John walked up there and, and Jesus yes, was transfigured. Mm -hmm. They saw who he really was. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Now, the believer has Christ in him. Yes. Come on, honey. And so what the world needs to see is Christ yes. and not our hypocritical yes. selves that, that we care about. Yes. Yes. You, you see what I'm saying? So Paul is saying, uh, don't, 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 don't conform yourself to this world. Mm -hmm. And I think we could take in religion. Mm -hmm. There's a uh, thing that we're going to do, do the best we can. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm always do right. Mm -hmm. Come on, Harvey. I'm always treat people like I want to be treated. Mm -hmm. Stop lying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Amen. That's right. That's right. But you can treat people like you want to be treated. Mm -hmm. yeah. If the inner man mm -hmm. is doing the treating. Mm -hmm. Amen. Once we step up to the plate, yes. there's no telling what may happen. Yes, yes sir. True. That's true. That's true. Amen. You Amen. see what I'm saying? Amen. And this is what Paul is talking about here. Mm -hmm. Amen. Be you transformed. But don't be conformed to this world. Don't act like you still belong to this world. You don't belong Amen. to this world. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You belong to, to God. Amen. Thank you. Lord. You've been rescued from the power of darkness. Yes. Now yes. Down to the to the uh, light of his dear son. That's where you are now. So walk in him. You see what I'm saying? And so he was saying, be transformed. And that transform takes a what? A period of years. Yes. Years. Years. 
and you don't get there, let me see, if you're trying yourself, eventually you're going to give up. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. That's true. Your church started to tie. Mm -hmm. And then you will start to take on your surroundings. Mm -hmm. Yes. Or yeah. what's available yeah. for you to, to take on. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because you've been trying yourself for so many years to be a good little Christian. Mm -hmm. And you know in your heart you're not a very good little Christian. <laughs> Amen. And I'm not saying you, 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 you're not... You, you're a bad Christian, but you're not a good Christian in the sense that what you do is through the flesh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. You can be nice in the flesh, yeah. Amen. But, but, Amen. You, but you have a reason for being nice. nice. Mm -hmm. Amen. What's your reason for being nice? What's your reason for being kind? Do you love this person? Perfect. If you don't love that person, then your reason for being kind and merciful is no good. Yeah. There's no value in it. Mm -hmm. Amen. Because it's not Christ. It is you. Yeah. And most times you have a a particular reason why you are showing a little compassion mm -hmm. and you're going to be nice to somebody. Yeah. you got an ultimate plan somewhere in the back yeah. of your mind. Yeah. Yeah. I will, I'm going to get this done. Mm -hmm. This is my goal. Yeah. You see, this is my goal. This is what I want. <laughs> but I'm going to be nice. Mm -hmm. And I can masquerade mm -hmm. until I get what I want. Mm -hmm. And then you can, 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 if you get what you want, then you can, can continue to masquerade. Mm -hmm. But the real... Christ in you never has a chance to express himself. Mm -hmm. That's why he said, present your that dead body mm -hmm. that Christ has already crucified mm -hmm. on the cross and you, you reckon yourself to be dead. You present that body. Mm -hmm. You present that body then God has a chance to what? Work on your mind. Yes, yes, yes. yes. On your mind. Yes. Yes. See, uh, we, we said many times before a tree of knowledge of good and evil is the most the tree of knowledge of good and evil and the tree of life, there are two principles here. Mm -hmm. The tree of knowledge of good and evil is how to do good and not evil. Mm -hmm. The principle of the tree of life is to is life itself. Yes, Lord. The life of life of God. Oh, yes. That's right. Now, when you when you when you get to a point that you stop living in the spirit, then you live in where? In the principle of of, 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 of uh, what's good and what's not good. Right wrong. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that good? Is that good? Is that good? Um, hard? Nope. Because you're basing your 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 uh, decision on what the world has decided what good and what not. Yes, yeah, right, right, wrong. Come on. Man. You see, it, it, if you, it is not based on life. Mm -hmm. Come on here. Have you seen what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's not based on life. It's based on on what, what you think or right. what your other brothers and sisters think or what the philosophy of the world is being taught mm -hmm. or what Dr. Field says or what Dr. Steve Harvey oh, says. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, you base uh, act like a man, or think like a man, and act like a woman. Yes. <laughs> what the most stupidest thing I've ever heard in my life? <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
But now it's embraced. Yeah. Get all the children you can. Oh, yeah. Come on back to the welfare program. Yes, I don't right. have all the children. Yeah. Welfare, they'll take care of you. Yeah. 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 And dad don't send that, mama don't send that. Yeah. Everybody like it's all right. It's, yeah. it's, it's fine. Mm -hmm. You see, to get to a point of where the, 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 the principle of what God wants is being blurred yes. to the fact yeah. that, that you don't know we, you don't know nothing. Mm -hmm. All those oh, things have been given, yeah. taken away. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, the, the transformation occurs when you stay with Jesus. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually, the principle of forsaking evil and following good is a, is a bad principle. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. I ain't going to do it because it's wrong. Mm -hmm. What? We go over here, it might be right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, what's wrong with that? Fix it. Fix it. Yes, yeah. yeah, sir. What, what's right in your house may be wrong in my house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I can't base Come on here. on that. Yeah. That has to be a life principle, work yeah. life, and that's love. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because sometimes love sees things. And it doesn't say anything. Yes, amen. But the right is a, a wrong and right here. Wrong, right gonna say the thing, and wrong gonna say. It. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you just leave it alone. Mm -hmm. If the spirit is leading you that yeah. way, yes, sir. sometimes you, you have to you rebuke Lord. it, like we Thank talked you. about this morning. But uh -huh. most of the time, if we want to be led by the spirit, yeah. and the uh, word is to say it, how you handle yourself, how you conduct yourself, what you should you say, what, should you say it, how should you say it, can I say it? Or when I should say it, yes. you, you've been led by the Spirit at, at those times. Mm -hmm. But when you see something, you get all fried and mad and, and I go attack it. Oh, you remember? Mm -hmm. Well, that's, I don't think, that's a lot of work done there in Christ. Mm -hmm. The yes, principle sir. of right, of good and evil. The knowledge of good and evil is like this. This is what I've gotten over the years myself personally. And I think Scripture teaches this. Is that the knowledge the word knowledge, is, I think it has another epinosis mm -hmm. of good and evil. Mm -hmm. Now see, some people are so, are so clever, they use, they decide to use good and evil. Mm -hmm. And they use good and evil for their own particular purposes. Mm -hmm. All right now. See, it's a knowledge of good and evil. How can I use this to get what I want. Mm -hmm. How can I use good to get what I want? Mm -hmm. How can I use this principle of evil to get what I want? Mm -hmm. Can I plant an evil thought here mm -hmm. and over a period of time I will get something beneficial to me? Mm -hmm. Can I say something nice here sure. at the same time I'm scheming mm -hmm. to get yeah. something over here? Yeah. Yeah. So that's the principle of, of, of the knowledge of good and evil. See, it's a knowledge of how to use good things and evil things to, to fulfill my own purpose. Mm -hmm. well, mm -hmm. well, to get what I desire. Well, to get what I want. Mm -hmm. I'll tell my wife anything as mm -hmm. long as I get my way. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell a lie as mm -hmm. long as I get my way. Yeah. I'll tell the truth. But my truth is actually well, designed to get my way. Mm -hmm. What I want. Yeah. That's what I said. When you learn that the, how you how you can manipulate truth and evil and lies mm -hmm. to, to get what you want, and this is a principle that Satan uses in the world today. Yeah, yeah. He's a god of this world. Yeah. He's a liar and a murderer, and yeah. the truth and the, the truth not in it. Mm -hmm. If a lie, he told it. Yeah. Oh, so if, he, if the if the if your whole life is spent, your whole, uh, think, thinking is spent on good and evil. Then you run right in the ram where he wants you. Yes, he can sir. use you. Yes. Mm. Amen. Because that's where he is. Mm -hmm. Amen. He's so clever. Yes, he is. Right and wrong. Mm -hmm. This is right. This is not right. It is. This is wrong. It's not wrong. And so you wind up fussing and, and whining about that mm -hmm. instead of about allowing Christ to lead you and guide you around those pitfalls Amen. and Satan and Satan. Amen. This is what Paul is talking about here. And see, once you once, once you allow Christ to, I think that word that uh, Witness Lee used, metabolically. Mm -hmm. You know what metabolically means? That means that you took some cyanide mm -hmm. <coughs> and what happens? Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you just get small doses here. Mm -hmm. What happens? That's weak. 
Well, eventually, over a period of time, over a period of time you gon you gonna cease to be. <laughs> and it happens in a process. A little bit here, a little bit there, and maybe four or five years down the road, you dead. And the doctors can't find anything because the the cyanide can is untraceable. Right? You, you, uh, you're a nurse, so you you know how to do that if you need to do that. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. But so, to, when Christ comes into your life, metabolically, the process happens. Come on here. Instead of killing you, mm. allowing you to remain dead, he makes you alive. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. He goes through every fiber of you. Come on here. Your emotions. He sets them. Your desire, your will, your mind, everything about you is affected by this presence of this glorious Christ yes. in you. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Absolutely. Thank you. You, you see what I'm saying? Yes. Once Christ comes in, uh -huh. then he begins to orchestrate or to go through everything about you as a person. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, transforming, yes. The transforming yes, process. Yes. He's changing you yes. from what? The inside, and it shows up where? Oh, On God. the outside. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. you. You see what I'm saying? Now, the, the thing is, as the, as the um, sign I work to kill you over a process of time, it doesn't have to necessarily be cyanide. It could be you, you, you take a lot of sugar. And sugar is not very good. Mm -hmm. So if you take a lot of sugar in over a period of time, you're gonna see the effects of that sugar has yeah. on your yeah. on your whole body yeah. and on your inner yeah. in, who you are. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes it is. And you eat too much fat. Yeah. Eat too much uh, whatever. You take too many drugs. Mm -hmm. You take too many alcohol sips. Or eventually it's gonna it, it's going to destroy you yeah. from the inside out yes, because it got into your whole body. I'm sure you've, you, you've experienced this. You talk to a man, that if he drinks a lot, you can actually smell it through his skin. Yeah, yes. 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 Yeah. Yeah. True. And you, you, you experienced that. Yes. A person that smokes a lot, yeah. he doesn't have to be smoking, no. but no. if he comes near you, no. you know he, he's a smoker because it comes, he can be washed skin. and clean, but it comes through his skin. skin. Yes. Mm -hmm. And this is the same principle that Paul is uh, discussing with us. Once Christ comes in, okay. mm -hmm. the process <laughs> of transforming occurs. Come on here. Can you see? It's so beautiful. The transforming occurs yeah. because Christ, it, not only that, but it doesn't occur naturally. Mm -hmm. Just because you have Christ in you, yes. the transforming doesn't happen naturally as it does with a, a caliper or something yeah. of that nature. Yeah. You have to cooperate yeah. with him yeah. and allow that transformation yeah. to, to occur. Yes. That's yes. what I'm saying. Yes. It makes sense to me. Yes. And it's, it's beautiful. And as you as you as you grow in Christ, the more of that transforming effect yes, sir. happens and it, it, it expresses outwardly. Mm -hmm. You can't you can't uh, be transformed from anything to anything unless it showed up somewhere else. Come on here, Harvey. Mm -hmm. uh, you go to the doctor and he asks you what you what you what 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 you eat? He said, well, you didn't have to tell him I know that because I yeah. see it. Yeah. <laughs> I, I know that. And, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. It's coming out of you. And so the, 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 the believer, what he wants coming out of him is that that Christ in him. Yes, sir. And Christ can't actually do what he needs to do unless some things are removed. Okay. So he can he can grow. Yeah. And those things that are removed have already been taken care of at the cross, mm -hmm. but we have to reckon it to be so. Yeah. And all this transformation can occur and we express him outward where everyone can see him. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Now, mm -hmm. the, the believer has to have his mindset on transformation. Okay, that's key. Mm -hmm. You see what? That's good. 
Yeah. The believer himself. Now, you don't, you don't get this through traditional teaching and through erroneous teaching and through selfish reason why a pastor is, is preaching or saying something. You get this through through the scriptures and through the, the, the teachers who have God's interest in mind. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's true. If I have just your interest in mind, I may not be giving you this. Mm -hmm. Because I have other reasons for giving you this. Mm -hmm. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. But when you're giving a, a, a believer this on Christ's behalf, that's who it, that's who it is. Mm -hmm. It's not on my behalf mm -hmm. because I'm dealing with this myself. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm being transformed myself. I'm not perfect here. I'm being transformed. So when you see me make mistakes, you say, well, how he transformation himself. You see what I'm saying? So it's not about me. It's not about anything else but then by Christ and his church and what he wants that, that the, the believer to express in his daily walk and daily activities he wants to, to express himself. That life, that little life that you have, it will grow, but only grow at a rate that you will lead into His Word. Yes, sir. Amen. That's the key. Transformation only occurs because you desire to occur. Mm -hmm. And uh, as I was speaking this morning, God is in charge, and He's going to get His way. Yes, Lord. And, Amen. Um, and, and I don't care what kind of Christian you are, eventually you're going to be with Him. Amen. But the process uh, that He that your final process may not be all that loving. Mm -hmm. Going to the the uh, lake of fire, not lake of fire. We call that lake of fire. Out of darkness. Mm -hmm. But see, you can avoid out of darkness on this side yeah. by uh, complying mm -hmm. with yes, Him. Yeah. 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 You see what I'm saying? Yeah. And doing those things that that He requires. Yeah. Not just uh, good and bad. Mm -mm. I ain't going to the chip. Mm -mm. I want to park there. I want to wear that. Shut your mouth and just love people, yes, and you'll be surprised Lord. how God can do some work through you. Yes, sir. Yeah, amen. Mm -hmm. First thing that transformation does, as far as I'm concerned, uh, it helps you to distinguish between uh, love and, and, and hate mm -hmm. and dislikes. Mm -hmm. I believe all not dislike anybody. Mm -hmm. God so loved the world, so yes, what you got in you, boy? Mm -hmm. You got God in you? You got the Holy Spirit there? You got Christ in you? Why are you hating? Come on, Amen. Well, now you, now you could be hating right now, but as that transforming continue to work, yes. yes. there, 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 there's less hating. Yes. And eventually there will be no hating. Yes. So Christ is expressed in all of that. Yes. It is Him that does the work. Yes. And He said, uh, and he will continue to work. He never done a good work. Yes. We'll continue to do the work. Yes. 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 Right. So it's not that a, a believer gets to a point in his life where he's, he's all right. Mm -hmm. No. Yes. You may be well grown and full grown in some areas, but yeah. there's still some work need to be oh, yeah. done. Yeah. 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 So we, we should never boast ourselves in ourselves. Yeah. We should only yeah. boast yeah. ourselves in Christ. Right. Yeah. 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 So transforming is a, is a tremendous work. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, we have to. I want to be transformed. I want to be in shaped in the image of my of, of God's son. Yes. Now there's a scripture that's in uh, Matthew chapter 15, verse 8. So let's, let's look at that way quick. Matthew chapter 15, verse 8. I'm sorry I believed that for so long, but I want to lay that, that footwork. Mm -hmm. uh, 15 and I think it's 15 and 8. Yeah, yeah. We're reading that Bible study. Yeah, you praise God. Amen. Amen. Uh, there are hey. people who honor me with their lips. See, yeah. that's the that's the conforming to this that's world. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, you look good, bro. Yeah. You're yeah. right, man. Mm -hmm. But in a heart, they hate me. You honor me with your lip, but your the, the, the place that needs to be transformed yeah. is a is a long way from me. Mm -hmm. Long way. Long way. See, the, the inner, part, inner part of man is not his, that little muscle that beats him, mm. but it, who he is. Yeah, yeah. His being. Yes. Soul, spirit. No, 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 no. It's soul, mind, body, and spirit. And your emotions and your will. You see? 
That's you. And when you when you die, your body going back to the dust. Mm -hmm. But all that part of you that's invisible, that's non corporal, it goes to be somewhere. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, then to the paradise to be with Jesus. Mm -hmm. You see, mm -hmm. now Paul, uh, uh, John, uh, Matthew said, "Why well, call?" What was that? Verse eight. Mm -hmm. Look at verse seven first. So he leads around the line that you hypocrites. <laughs> Why well, is there a prophesied concerning your saying? Mm -hmm. This people yeah. honors me with their lips, but their hearts stays far away from me. Mm -hmm. See, God wanted to get that heart. Mm -hmm. What shall a prophet man do? What gain the whole world and lose his soul? Yeah. Or what shall a man give in exchange what for his soul? So Paul is actually talking to the, the, the Roman believers. Here about their very being, which is their soul. Mm -hmm. And your mind has a lot to do with working out your soul salvation with fear and trembling. Mm -hmm. Now, another one is uh, uh, Romans chapter, no, I'm sorry, Galatians chapter 2, uh, verse 19, 20. You're all familiar with that one. Mm -hmm. But it does encourage us to go look at that every now and then because there's so much being, uh, being shared here. Mm -hmm. The Galatians 2.20. Yeah. And because Paul is saying now who is reigning here. Yeah. Yeah. Paul is saying now where the transformation is and how it is occurring. Right? I am crucified with Christ, yes. yeah. chapter, Galatians chapter 2, verse 20. I am crucified with Christ. Mm -hmm. It is no longer I. Who, who's, who's, who's transforming us now? Yeah. It is Christ. Mm -hmm. It's no longer I. Mm -hmm. But Christ is doing what? He's doing the work. Yeah. But I am allowing him to do the work. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm allowing him to strip me. Yeah. I'm allowing him to break me. Okay. I'm allowing him to mold me yeah. and to shape me yeah. into his own image. Yes. Yes. Because there are two eyes still here. Yes. The, the, but the, the big, big eye was the, is, is Christ. Right. That's who's doing the work. Yes. But I'm submitting to it. Yes, sir. So you can get the, Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. I am crucified with Christ. No longer I. Mm -hmm. I, I, I stop forming my thoughts. Sure. And I take on Christ. Yes. Mm -hmm. Who live, but it, it is I who Christ lives in me. Mm -hmm. That the what the transforming is like, but the transforming work, which now I live in the flesh, mm -hmm. in the faith of the Son of God who loved me and gave Himself for me, up for me. Yes. See, it is Christ that does the work, mm -hmm. but we have to consent to Him mm -hmm. because we still have what a we will of our own. Yes. 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 I'm not doing this. I, 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 can't, I can't deal with it. Yeah. Well, step back out of the way, and the greatest he is in you, he can do it. You can't do it. And that's what I say about it. If you don't get proper teaching, what you wind up doing is creating your own little ideologies, your own little, um, your own little religious things you do uh, to look good and to sound good and to smell good, but you really, in uh, no way, are, is, is in transformation here. Glory. You're not being transformed. Mm -hmm. You're still you're still taking on religious activities, ideologies, and things of that nature, good and right and wrong. And you look at people, and what you do, you don't see the people. You see what they're doing. Mm -hmm. Come on, Harvey. I, I wouldn't do that. How do you know you wouldn't do that? Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, you, you don't stop judging folks. Amen. Let them do what they want to do. Yeah. Amen. But you just be there for Christ. Yeah. And love, let him love through you for that person. Mm -hmm. Amen. One more. I think it's one more here. Glory. Proverbs. Proverbs uh, chapter 20. Chapter 23, verse 6 and 8. And this is all about yeah. Is it that, that yeah, the one, Jack? Yeah, that's the man thinks. <laughs> and I see the scriptures are very clear on on this, on this transformation. Twenty six, one, twenty three. Twenty three, twenty three, six. 
23.6? I think we got it. Good gracious. 23 and 8. Is the Proverbs? Yes, right. For he thinks within himself, so is he. Read out there. Verse 7. Yes. For as a man thinks, mm -hmm. this has to do with the mind. Mm -hmm. And that Paul asked us earlier to caution and be transformed by what? Renewing of your mind. Mm -hmm. for, for as he thinks himself, so is he. Mm -hmm. He says to you, eat and drink. Mm -hmm. But it's what? His heart is not with you. This is when you sit with people and you, you ain't got no control of your appetite. Mm -hmm. well. And I'm not talking about physical food here. Mm -hmm. But I'm talking about apples and oranges and uh -huh. peach and ice cream. But I'm talking about that. It, it could be the case. Mm -hmm. But now we want to look further than that. Here. We're talking about the ideas mm -hmm. and the teaching mm -hmm. and things that is trying to seduce the spiritual doctrines mm -hmm. of devil. Mm -hmm. He could be sitting there smiling, mm -hmm. uh, patting you on the back. And it sends you a pack of lies. Amen. Right? Mm -hmm. Amen. He said, he said, be careful. Number six. Read number six. Uh, mm -hmm. Do not eat the bread of one who is envious. Mm -hmm. So be careful. True. Mm -hmm. See, all that has to do with your mind. Yeah. And all that has to do with, with your transformation. Mm -hmm. see, see, the world is trying its best to keep you conformed to its pattern. Mm -hmm. Christ is working to keep you conformed to his pattern. Yes. Yeah. And you have a big role to play in it because you stand right in the middle here. You either is or you ain't. Right? Either you're for me or what? You're against me. You can't serve God and serve God and mammon at the same time. Somewhere you gotta make a decision who you're gonna serve. God or a mammon. Amen. That's what I meant by that. And one more, then we close it. Four twenty three Proverbs. Is a uh, uh, do what? Yeah, All right, now, now again, we get back to the what man's being is. He's mm -hmm. not talking about that little piece of muscle that pumps your blood here. He's talking about you, mm -hmm. the the. The invisible you, the heart can be seen. It can be taken out and replaced with, a, with something else. It can be taken out and thrown away. But this is what he said. You really are. Your mind, your will, your body, your conscience, and your desires, your emotions. That's who you are. Right? That's who you are. And so he said, uh, 23, he says, What was that? From that So make sure you you watching over what entered into your what heart, your heart. That your emotions, something from out here is going to attack your emotions. Something out here is going to attack your will. Something out here is going to attack your mind. Something going to attack your desires. Something always something from the outward. From the environment gonna come in and mm -hmm. try to attack you. Yes. But if you if you have Christ there, He's going to deal with that when it comes. But you have to be the one that is practicing that. He's at the door. Here it comes. Here come a lie. Here comes a, the false doctrine. What do you do? You, 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 you're going to try to deal with it. You can't deal yeah, with it. Yeah, try to figure it out. You need a lie detector. <laughs> you, need a lie detector. Yeah. Right. you need a lie detector. Mm -hmm. And a lie detector who? The lie detector is Christ. Yes. Be you transformed by what? Renewing mind. of your mind. The natural mind can be transformed also, but not in the sense of Christ talking about here. Yes. So you can go up there. Um, you know, she done changed. Boy, that girl that's smart. That's a, and she got a degree. In, in writing, one is a philosophy, and another one in this, another one in that. And she's spitting out stuff, but it had nothing to do with Christ. Mm -hmm. yeah. Whole lot of filibuster and, and mm -hmm. jaw jacking, but yeah. nothing about yeah. Christ. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <a jaw -jack. laughs> 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. You see, the wisdom of this world, yeah. Christ has made an open shore of it by the resurrection of the dead. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And see, we, 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 we tend to elevate or applaud those who have these big degrees. Mm-hmm. I'm not against degrees. I'm just degrees at a high Christ. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Amen. Ain't nothing wrong with a degree. You, you want a degree? Go get one. Mm-hmm. But don't let this degree conform you to this word the way the world thinks. Amen. Mm-hmm. Amen. You, you see Amen. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It makes a big difference. And Paul said, uh, I had a scripture in the book of Philippians, uh, all things are, are learned, uh, mm-hmm. kind yes. of a yes. dumb yes. collection yes. of yes. Christ. Mm-hmm. Paul had a degree in Pharisee uh-huh. and yeah. Sadducees yeah. and yeah. religion yeah. and yeah. Mosaic yeah. system. Yeah. He was a big shot yeah. there yeah. in Jerusalem, yeah. and, uh, yeah. there in Tarsus. Yeah. But when he met Christ, yeah. 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 Oh, that's oh. Oh. That's that I might be conformed yeah. to the image yeah. of God's oh. Son. Yeah. Yeah. I got to get rid of this stuff, man. Yeah. Yeah. This stuff is hindering me yeah. from becoming. God's yeah. looking like Jesus. Yeah. I can't hold on to it because it's going to hurt me. Yeah. When I get a judgment and see the grave, all he sees is that stuff and he goes, run right up the street. Yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Transform it. Transform. You need a transforming mind so it can transform the all those stuff for the soul, the mind, the will, the emotion. You look more and more like Jesus every day because the transforming power of Christ is working in your in your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Was that all right? Yeah. Praise God. Transforming. Transforming. We need that. Now see, something. Let me close it. Something else happens when you transform. Uh, the world don't know you. Yeah, the world loves his own. Earl, mm-hmm. how can the world know, know you when you transform? Mm-hmm. They can see you, yeah. but they have no idea who you are. Yeah. 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 When you talk, what? Mm-hmm. Me and Jane talk about that. When you talk, they don't know what you're talking about. Mm-hmm. When you discuss money and finances mm-hmm. and homes and, and clothing, mm-hmm. your, your conversation is in another realm. Yeah. 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 So yeah. Yeah. what? Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. You don't like that show? It's a, it's a nice show. It's a black show. It's called Blackish. You don't like it? Aren't you black? Yeah, this is a house that this is a house that Jesus lived in. We have to be black when I'm black, black. This house is the house is black, but I'm I'm a, I'm a spiritual person. Yes, sir. Remember that. Keep you. You seen the show? Come on. It's, it's, it's kind of, I've seen the commercial. When I saw the commercial, it was enough for me. I don't even watch it. It's black. I don't even watch it. This is just to make you sick. It, it just is. the name itself. It is. I don't even watch it. Remember, yes. God is transforming you. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Yes. He's gonna bring you up to be just like His son. Yes. What's on this this side of? After you come out, uh, where called the place? Out of darkness and Gehenna, you gonna look just like Him. Yes, sir. But I'd rather. On this side, yeah. do my part. Yeah. 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 So that I won't have to suffer that thousand years. Yeah. But I've been thanking God while I'm suffering. Yeah. I'm with, oh, thank you, Jesus. I wish I'd have done that out here. But thank you, Jesus. Yes. I wish I'd stop lying out here. But yes. thank you, Jesus. Yes. I wish I'd stop cursing. I wish I'd stop all that stuff. Say, I wish I had to stop this out there. But thank you, God. You, you're cleaning me up now. So when I come out of thousand years, I'll be just like you. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Just like you. Yes. Any questions or any comments on those spots?